Hi, my name is Beth and we're here with 10 Minutes With with the Tea Sisters today. How are you all doing today? Hey, awesome. Thanks for having us, Beth. Are you having a good time at Winter Wondergrass so far? Heck it's yeah. Been very really fun so far. Yeah? Yeah, Love we just it. did our first set and it was a blast. The crowd was definitely moving, so that's good. Were there any specific bands you were really excited to hear while you were here? Well, Fruition. We love Fruition. Nikki Bloom and the Gramblers. Brothers coming to us. I'm going to start naming all the bands that are here because basically everybody, Front Country, um, Dust Bowl Revival. Elephant Revival. Of Elephant Revival. Yeah. It's kind of like a Everything. big meeting of friends. So I was saying, yeah, this friends was definitely the festival for you ladies then. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Good. I'm yeah. looking forward to seeing Green Sky and Bluegrass. So. Oh, yeah, we yeah. looked them up earlier. They, they're... Have you seen them before? I, I haven't seen don't them think before, I have no. seen them before. Okay, good. Very nice young yeah. men. Yeah. Very um, nice young men. <laughs> could you tell us a little bit about your um, influences? Sure. Well, we grew up uh, listening to a lot of folk music via our mom, a lot of 60s, 70s folk music and R&B from around that time, and then definitely a lot of 90s R&B as well. Girl groups. Like yeah. Groups. Do you have some favorite singer? Yeah. Yeah. Aretha Franklin. Oh, good Donny choice. Donny Hathaway. Stevie Wonder. Joni Mitchell. Mm -hmm. James Taylor. Bonnie Ray. Mama Cass. <laughs> we could yeah. go on. Uh, and beautiful on and choices. On. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, what's your favorite uh, part about being on tour? Well, <laughs> we get to hang out together we get to spend all so much the time. time. We're this close all the time. <laughs> yeah, pretty well, much. Well, it's really fun to come to places like this where we get to see amazing musicians, be inspired by them, connect with them, um, see our friends. It's nice to have family. At Noticing home, the in a more way. the more I come to these things, it seems like a big family reunion. It's mm -hmm. really nice. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It feels it's like, like we that. see a lot of these people who live, you know, all over the country in the state more than we see a lot of folks in our hometown so so it does feel like a big old big old party whenever we go out and plus when we go on tour people are really hospitable we stay in a lot of people's homes and they always cook us food and take good care of us so it's nice to see oh, how, yeah. how open-hearted everybody is you got to meet our friends jam the band last year actually. yeah how was that that was really, really fun. fun that's a great group yeah. of guys yeah yeah. We're really excited to see them again this year at High Sierra. Great, I'm sure okay. they would love to see you, yeah. you ladies again. Yeah, great time <laughs> there. To connect with them again. Really mm -hmm. fun. Can you tell us about, is there a new album on the way? There is, yes. Yeah, so in the um, incubator. Well, we just released an EP after our newest full-length album. So we released an EP in early 2015, and we are getting ready to record a live album this summer. So hopefully we'll oh, pop wow. that out in the early fall. And a live album, too. That's yeah. awesome. What was it like singing the national anthem, the Giants game? Oh. <laughs> it was very special. You sounded beautiful. Yeah, it was really cool. It was, it was we were nervous about it, especially because people had cautioned us about the huge delay factor that would happen when we were singing it. But we got on the field and, I don't know, it just all kind of clicked and it made sense. And then doing it just... We actually got to have fun and in the in the experience and enjoy being in that moment. I felt, you know, not nervous. But an experience while we were doing for three it, sisters so. to enjoy together. That's great. Yeah. 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 It was very cool. Kind of triumphant. Very what was cool. that feeling when you sang the last note and then the crowd? I mean, it was yeah, great. It was, it was good. It was kind of funny almost. I think I started laughing in one of the videos because <laughs> it felt very surreal. Curious, there's you three, then how'd you meet the rest of your band? Well, we met our bass player a few years back at swing a dancing. swing dance event. Yeah, I was I was working on promoting a big swing dance event in the East Bay, and we went out to go see some live music and dancing in San Francisco, and he was playing there with his Western Swing Band, and we got to be friends after that, and reconnected at a music festival, and then the bass player we were playing with at the time he he was getting really busy with his new job yeah. and so we have a great band <laughs> we picked him up and then andy we just started playing with andy our mando slash guitar player uh, a couple months ago and we met him first 
actually when he came down to sort of try out for the band, but we met a friend of his in Bend, Oregon, and we hmm. we kind of put the word out that we were looking for a full time another full time player, and it just all fell into place. Oh, good. Awesome. And yeah. then uh, one more question, actually. I keep saying one more question. <laughs> but um, I was researching you ladies, and I saw, I'm really into art, and I saw that you have actually a museum down in the Bay Area, or you work with. Could you tell me a little bit about that? Well, it's a, it's more of a theater collective okay. that, we, that we co-founded together. Um, and some aspects of the theater collective are visual art, some of it is um, musical art, musical theater, which is how we began the Tea Sisters. We started more with musical theater, and then we transitioned into whatever it is we do, Americana folk, or whatever you want to call it. Um, Tea Sisters music. <laughs> and in the, in the collective, we do variety shows and parades, and we have we involve a lot of other people. So it's really hands-on and everything, and yeah. really in, into the community. That's awesome. Yeah. Thank you so much. And I appreciate your time today. And this is 10 Minutes With, and this was the Tea Sisters at Winter Wondergrass. Thanks for having me.